What's up? I just wanted to do a quick video on the caravan again. Um, we're hearing a lot from the Democrats. I want you to keep in mind the Democrats are historically the racist slave owners of the United States. If you don't study history, you're bound to repeat it. So anyway, the Democrats keep bringing up the 14th Amendment for why President Trump cannot uh, get rid of birthright citizenship, meaning uh, immigrants, illegal immigrants coming to this country, having babies, uh, can then have an anchor baby because the baby can then become a citizen immediately. The 14th Amendment does not cover that. If you go back, really, what the 14th Amendment was about, it was about how many people brought slaves to this country from other countries. Those people were brought to this country against their will. They did not want to come here. They were enslaved. They were forced to come here and they were forced to work. So really what the 14th Amendment did was it... Uh, it enabled those people, it empowered them to be treated properly uh, by the citizens of this country as equals once they were freed from slavery. Because many of those uh, black slaves were freed and they were still treated as second class, uh, almost as animals, not as people. And so what the 14th Amendment did, which also undermines another Democrat uh attempt is it allowed the blacks to keep their guns as the second amendment because they were taking the guns from what they considered slaves and second class citizens uh you had marshals across the u.s confiscating firearms uh 14th amendment allowed those people to keep them for self-defense purposes uh against the the government and against people who would come to cause them harm the black people really needed their Second Amendment rights and the Democrats are always for slavery. So they want to take those rights away from you. They also don't want you to be treated as a human being. And by their applying the 14th Amendment to these caravan people who are not coming here against their will, they're coming here by their will. It is their will that is driving them to walk from their country up to the United States and to dishonor the United States by not uh, really carrying our flag here. Uh, what they're doing is they're burning our flag. They're also carrying their Honduran flags over, draped over their shoulders. If they don't like what's going on in Honduras, why are they honoring Hondura, Honduras by carrying its flag? So we can see that there's a lot more to this caravan and a lot more to this argument that the Democrats are really supporting uh, the caravans to undermine the 14th Amendment, which benefits the citizens, the black citizens of this country. This is why the Democrats don't understand what they're doing. The, when you have this Blexit move where the black people are exiting the Democratic Party and no longer voting, and Trump has a historic support from black Americans uh, in this this polling and this election, the, the Democrats stupidly don't realize they're undermining themselves. They're hanging themselves uh, by supporting this caravan because they're really revealing themselves as the racists that they always have been. And they keep saying that there was this switch that happened where the, the racists left the Democratic Party and came to the Republican Party. Nay, I say, negative. The Democratic Party has always been the party of racists. Always, always, always. Their policies have not changed. Their behaviors have not changed and their views have not changed. You're seeing it with Hillary Clinton, how she made the joke about how all blacks look alike because the one uh, interviewer uh, confused uh, Cory Booker with uh, Eric Holder. Uh, and, you know, maybe she did confuse it off of memory. Uh, but there was this joke about how, oh, yeah, I know how they all look alike. How racist is that? And, uh, you know, you, you keep getting all of these racist remarks. And look at how uh, Megyn Kelly was removed from her position.
for making a comment that, yeah, you could dress up like a black person or like a, another race for Halloween without offending people. And people got offended. But yet uh, you can have Don Lemon on CNN say that white people are the main problem, the terrorism and the, the cause of shootings in this country. And yet he still remains on CNN. So the Democrats and the leftist media are really revealing who they are. This election, you need to pay attention to who you're voting for. Make sure you know your people and really think twice before you vote Democrat. If you're a, a minority and you're voting Democrat, man, you don't even realize that Barack Obama signed the Real ID Act. Okay, you know what the Real ID Act is? It creates a real ID for American citizens Meanwhile, they let all these immigrants in and they give them these fake IDs. They, they issue driver's licenses to them and these IDs, but those IDs will not allow you to leave the country because you will not be allowed to fly. You will not be allowed into federal buildings. So at some point, the Democrats have this secret that they're going to enslave all the minorities that come to this country. And they're giving you this idea that you're getting benefits and you're getting these IDs which make you feel like you're a citizen, but the reality of it is you're not. And once you're here, you'll be trapped. You won't be able to leave. You won't be able to fly home once the Real ID Act is enacted. So minorities, immigrants from around the world, really think about what you're doing. The communists are not benefiting you. They're screwing you. And that's my message for today.